Hey guys, Extended here, and today we are back with the Future Stars uh, series, episode 2. Our first episode was about Leroy Sané, which we did do in the demo. Here in episode 2 is going to be on Osman Dembele, is I believe how you say it. You guys can see 19 years of age, only, um, or he has 5 star weak foot, 4 star skill move, so already a pretty good player for Dortmund. He's already in the starting lineup at right midfielder, or I don't know where he plays in real life, but here in FIFA, he could play a right mid, uh, left mid, or cam. So he has pretty good stats and we are going to see how he fares. We're going to play our first game here against Bayer Leverkusen. Okay, so here we are at the Signal Iduna Park, uh, Bayern Munich, or not Bayern Munich, Dortmund's home stadium, my bad, against uh, Bayer Leverkusen. Hopefully we could do well with um, Dembele at the right, but I've also heard from people that he is very good at uh, the center attacking mid position. Okay, we're going to take the throw in right over to Dembele. Can he work his way in the middle? He can. He's on his left foot now. He's going to take the shot, and Bern Leno does save it, and it does go out for a corner. So good little run right there from uh, Dembele. Hopefully we can get more chances like that later on in the game. Okay, Castro's on the ball. Let's get over to Aubameyang. Gets past his defender. Let's play it in. Over to Marco Royce. He's going to take the shot, and he can't follow it up. I could not find Dembele anywhere right there. Over to Guerrero down the wing. Left back has a lot of pace right there. Let's get it into the middle. There's Dembele right there. He's going to take the shot. And Leno does get it with his left hand to save it. That's his second save uh, off of Dembele right there. Okay, Wendell, their left back, is going up. They're, he's going to try to cross it into the box. We end up getting to it. Can we counter from this? Gets it over to Royce. There's Aubameyang. Where is Dembele? Why is he all the way on the left? There he is. We take the shot and we are up 1-0. Dembele, I guess it's good that he was playing on the left. Beautiful passing. I don't even know. There's uh, Aubameyang over to Goetze, I believe. Oh no, Royce to Goetze. Over to uh, Dembele, who wasn't offside, just by a hair. I think because they did have a defender on the ground. Takes the shot on his right foot and the number 7 hits it into the bottom right corner. And we are up 1-0. Play it into Dembele. Try to get around Wendell. We can. We're going to cross it in over to Marco Royce, who takes a shot over to Leno. Uh, saves it, but pretty good cross right there from Dembele. He's going to try to cross it in. Wendell does um, does block it, and it should be half time once Top Rack hits an upfield, and it is. So we're up 1 0. Beautiful goal right there from Dembele. Gets the ball onto his. Right foot or left foot? I don't know, but here's the first chance that he did miss. Leno with a nice save. We have five shots with all of them on target, and I think I'm playing on world-class difficulty. Difficulty. Let's let's check the performances. Dembele, you guys can see right there. Shots, all three of his shots are on target. His passing, it's okay. It could do a little bit better. He has one key pass, which is good, though. And his ball retention, he's lost all seven just because we... We're trying to get uh, goals with him, so he's never really going to pass it that much. So hopefully he can get more chances in the second half. No, we can't. But Dembele with the interception comes over to Aubameyang. Trying to get the ball to Dembele, but he's getting bullied off. Can top? Can he intercept it? He does intercept it from top rack. Working his way in the middle. Gets tripped up, so we do have a free kick. Beautiful little run from Dembele. No card, but uh, can we get a free kick with him? Okay, so we are going to take this with Dembele. Let's see his stats. They're not the best. Very bad, uh, in fact, but never hurts to try. We are up anyways. He takes a shot, and it goes right to Burn Leno. Uh, pretty much no chance of going in, but you guys can see that you don't really want to use him as your special or as your set-piece taker. They're going to cross it in. They're going to get a free header. And I knew that was going to score, or he, they were going to score right when they crossed it in. They had the ball for about 10 in-game minutes straight. Uh, they crossed it in right to the head of Javier Hernandez, and the score is 1-0. No need to see the replay. He's a little bit tired, but we're going to get it right back over to him. He's going to cross it in, and Castro gets to it. He takes a shot over to Leno, but he does save it in extra time or with a few minutes left in the game, and the game's probably going to end in a draw, but good cross right there from Dembele. They're going to kick it upfield. We get over to road, and that is the end of regulation. We're not going to play overtime just because my players are tired and I want to play with Dembele on full stamina, so we're just going to go into another game.
Okay, so we're going to play here against Tottenham, but we are playing in a different formation. I moved Mario Goetze over to the right, and now we're playing a 4-2-3-1 about, and Dembele is going to be playing right behind Aubameyang, just because I've noticed that Dembele likes to move over to the middle for some reason, so we're going to see how we fare against Tottenham with him playing in the middle. Okay, so here we are back at the Signal Aduna Park. Hopefully Dembele can do something, playing that attacking mid position, and he can work the ball onto either his left or right foot. We can't get it with Mario Goetze. He's going to pass it in the middle over to Harry Kane, who gets past Bartra, I believe, over to Deli Alley or Lamella, and it hits the post. Could have made it 1-0 here in the 25th minute, but we do manage to keep the score at 0-0. Mario Goetze with the interception, finds Dembele, over to Mario Goetze, sort of through. I see Aubameyang right there. Ball over to Dembele. He's going to take the shot, and it goes right under the goalkeeper. I don't know how I managed to pick him out with that pass. 1-0 um, before halftime, just like the last game. Dembele with his second goal in just as many games. Beautiful play from us right there. Goetze finds Aubameyang over to Castro, I believe, to Dembele. First touch right into the bottom left, uh, right underneath Hugo Lloris' right arm. And we are up 1-0 via Dembele's goal. And that is how the half would end. Uh, once the ball gets to Lamella, the referee blows the whistle. You guys can see, my bad, the match facts right there. We've had only two shots with one on target, but that last goal does help us going into the second half. They do have more tackles than us, but our, sh our pass accuracy is pretty good too. Let's check Dembele's performance. You guys can see 100% shooting. That was his only shot, and he did get a goal. Passing is a lot better, 91% right here. He has one key dribble, and his tackling, he's also 1-1 one -one too, so hopefully we can get another goal with him in the second half. Going to pass it in over to Aubameyang. I see Dembele right there. He gets tripped up in the box. And is that a penalty? No, that's a free kick right outside. And I don't care if we win these or not. So we're going to take it with Dembele once again. Can we score a goal with him with his not so good stats? He's going to take the shot. And it goes about a couple meters over the crossbar. But really good run from the whole team right there. Okay, Dele Alley passes over to Musa Dembele. Who's still on the ball. Going to play it in over to Harry Kane. Takes a shot, but Berkey with a beautiful save, knocks it out for a corner. Are they gonna be able to do anything right here? Christian Eriksen on the ball. When Yama comes in for Eric Deer, they're gonna cross it in, and we do get the ball away with Dembele. Only as far as Alderweireld, uh, Dembele, the other one on the ball, has it, still on it, but we do get it with Marco Royce again. Okay, so we have the ball right here on the throw-in. Let's get it back over to Guerrero, who finds Dembele. Terrible pass to Kyle Walker, but Guerrero intercepts it. Let's get it over to Dembele, who tries to find Aubameyang, and he's going to take the shot. Terrible shot right there. I could not turn around fast enough. But Dembele did get the nice little pass over to Aubameyang. Try to get it to Dembele, but the ball falls right back over to Goetze. To a non-offsides Dembele. Can we get past this defender? We can. He's going to take the shot from way out. Or not way out, but right inside the 18. Good shot, but Loris does save it. Maybe I should have went in a little bit more, but we can't do anything with that. I see Dembele making a little run. He's going to work his way towards the middle, try to get the ball over to somebody, but I couldn't. Dembele passes over to Road, try to get it down the wing to Marco Roy. Sissoko does intercept it, and that is full time. We do win 1-0 thanks to a goal from Dembele. We uh, scored both of our goals with Dembele. We tied our first game 1-1 and second game. Sorry, I just hit the mic. 1-0. Uh, we only had five shots, they had seven, so we did get pretty lucky right there. Our pass percentage did go down. Let's look at the performances right here. Dembele with the 8.9 rating, played all over the place. 66% shooting, which is okay. Passes 81%, which is also sort of decent. And his tackling, he actually uh, made a little bit of chances. So uh, if I were to pick this guy up in a career mode, I definitely would use him as a starter in a team that's sort of mid-table. And you could also play him as a starter here with Dortmund, but maybe you could find a more of a star player. Uh, in a few years, he will become one of your best players, and I would definitely try to play him in the attacking mid position because he can make a lot of runs in the box. But if you want to play him out wide, he does have a lot of pace. So I would definitely pick him up for a career mode and use him as a future star. So if you guys liked the episode, please like, comment, and subscribe. Tell me what you guys want to see, what you don't want to see, and who I should use next. See ya.